After many cliffhangers, fans of Manifest were left with more questions than answers at the end of Season 3. From the show getting cancelled to the much-anticipated release date of the last installment, and even some surprising theories expected to happen in future episodes, here's everything you need to know about Manifest Season 4. Netflix Saves the Day Before we get into details, let's talk about all the struggles that the creators of the series had to go in order for fans to get a proper conclusion to their favorite TV show. Manifest first premiered four years ago in 2018. The first episode was released on NBC with Flight 828 taking off. The show took the world by storm and it was quickly praised by both fans and critics. Because of the success of the first installment, NBC gave a green light to the second and third seasons. But they later realized that they made a mistake. At least that's what they thought. You see, the viewership numbers dropped a lot by Season 3, and if we compare the numbers, Season 1 had 12.61 million viewers on average, and the third installment had 6 million viewers. Is this what happened to us? Ben, did we crash? These In the summer of 2021, the creators gave up. They cancelled the series, with dedicated fans expressing their disappointment over the lack of answers. The show got cancelled after the finale of the third installment aired on June 10, 2021. And then, Warner Brothers Television, the owner of the show, licensed the first two seasons to Netflix on June 10, 2021. They, however, didn't expect the show to become an even bigger success. This just proves how content released on Netflix will always get more popularity than content released on any other streaming platform. Manifest stayed on the list of top 10 most watched TV shows on Netflix for quite some time, which was the main reason for the series being given a continuation. This is how Netflix saved the series. They made a deal with Warner Brothers to get all of the seasons and continue the series with a final part. The continuation was announced on August 28, 2021. According to The Hollywood Reporter, over 25 million had tuned in to watch the show on Netflix within 28 days. That's why the streaming giant got seriously interested in the series and, of course, its continuation. But did Netflix manage to gather the entire cast and crew for the next installment? Before we get to talk about returning cast members, release date, and expected plot, make sure you smash that like button if you haven't done it already. Release date We've previously established that Manifest is a TV show that has an expansive range of fans. This list of fans doesn't exclude celebrities. Did you guys know that Stephen King actually asked the creators of the series for more details regarding its continuation's release date? We believe you all know who the legendary Stephen King is, meaning that you're also familiar with the fact that this is a big deal. I mean, the king of sci-fi asking for more pieces of information about your favorite TV show is the same as when Queen Elizabeth told the world that she watched Downton Abbey. Anyway, let's see if the creators address King's questions. Responding to a fan on Twitter, Matt Long, who plays Zeke, wrote that the continuation of the show will be released sometime in the fall or winter of 2022. Creator Rake wrote the response to Stephen King, asking about the return of the series, I'm hearing November. We previously mentioned that this will be a supersized installment, meaning that the continuation will be divided into two parts, each part consisting of at least eight episodes. Per a TV Line report, due to being delivered in multiple parts of a quantity and frequency TBD, the Supernatural drama's farewell flight is on track to take off late this year. Thankfully, it has been announced that the entire continuation has been already filmed. You're gonna get yourself killed! I'm the one who caused it! I have to fix it! Returning cast members. As of June 2021, all of the actors' contracts expired. This was a problem for Netflix because a continuation would have never happened if the majority of the cast members didn't sign new contracts in September after the renewal. Thankfully, they did, well, most of them at least, Characters we don't expect to see in the continuation are those who died in the finale of Season 3, and well, those who have aged since the cancellation. Recently, it was announced that Daryl Edwards, who plays Vance, got promoted to series regular. Sadly, the creators also revealed that Jack Messina won't return for the anticipated continuation, which is also the case with amazingly talented Athena Karakanis, who portrayed Grey Stone. We're sure that fans will miss these two actors a lot. We feel the need to mention that there was a serious increase in the budget for each episode of the final season, as according to what's on Netflix, the show went from $1 million per episode to $4 or $5 million. According to what's on Netflix, there are some new character additions for the next installment. Kyle Boyd will join the show, who was a passenger on Flight 828. We'll also meet two additional characters named Tila and June, Captain Kevin Fahey, and Detective Price are two plus characters set to appear in Season 4. Some of the cast members have shared photos of the new season on their Instagram accounts. They look super enthusiastic, right? Plot 
plot. In order for fans to see a proper conclusion to the series, the creators will have to squeeze many storylines into only 20 episodes. This is a difficult task, I mean, considering the fact that the last installment lives on pretty high expectations. The increased budget will surely help this issue. In an interview with EW, the creator of the series said he's absolutely confident that 20 episodes give enough time to tell the entirety of the story as he intended to. Josh Dallas, who plays Ben, posted on Twitter that things are going to be a little different. Alongside a photo of him, a lot of fans started coming up with different theories regarding Dallas's new look, especially his long beard. Seeing this version of him was kind of expected because his character went through a huge loss in the last episodes of the series. A fan wrote, love the beard, but my heart is breaking for Ben. And Dallas responded with, to be honest, he's not in a great place. While chatting to TV Insider, Rake prepared fans for Ben's future while telling what kind of storylines he'll get involved in. He said that Ben's future is centered around processing, digesting, coming to emotional terms with such an unspeakable loss and then trying to find a way to seek vengeance. To kind of justify the act in terms of finding some meaning out of it, here's a photo of a funeral that will get featured in the future episodes that the creator shared on Twitter with a caption, brace yourselves. I have to go. No, no. Go where? Cal, please. Beverly and her major influence on the continuation. When it comes to reliable theories, the best place you can go to is Reddit. And if you go on Reddit to look for theories about Manifest Continuation, you'll notice that a lot of fans believe that Beverly will get involved in some of the biggest storylines and plot twists. These fans claim that she'll have some big connection to the Flight 828 passenger's powers in Season 4. As user reading 2080 wrote, She does seem different when she's around Zeke and some passengers. It's like they all have some kind of property or power that seems to make her either eerily lucid or something. Her encouragement of Angelina during the earthquake makes me feel like she knows more than she thinks she does. It's most obvious when she's around Zeke, and it's possible his abilities have something to do with it. This is why a lot of fans believe she'll have a more significant role in the continuation, but these are only theories, and only time will tell how reliable they are. As previously mentioned, filming for the new installment is all wrapped up, with the show last season premiering sometime in the fall or winter of 2022. If the first half releases in November, we might expect the second one to premiere sometime in January 2022 at the earliest. <laughs> On a related note, what are your hopes for the next installment? Let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed our video, make sure you subscribe to our channel so you'll never miss any of our videos in the future. As always, thanks for watching.